Thanks to you, our viewers, hundreds of toys will be going to less fortunate children this Christmas. Today, the Marine Corps Reserves picked up the toys that you dropped off here at the station. Noah Noble traveled with them to bring us this report. Every year, starting in October, this is like the Marine Corps mission. Gunnery Sergeant Augustor Campbell and his fellow Marine Corps reservists are loading up tons of toys collected at WLOX for the annual Toys for Tots drive. It's a mission that's near and dear to these Marines. I love it, especially when the parents see like they could receive a bike or if they receive a, a huge gift or something that they kid always wanted and they couldn't afford. And I, we love doing that. I love doing that. After the toys are loaded, these troops hit the road to collect even more toys donated by people in the community. And with these boxes packed away, the next stop is the Naval Construction Battalion Center, more commonly known as the CB Base. These are all donations from lovely people all across Mississippi. We bring them in, we bring them to the Marines, and the Marines will take them to the boxes designated for each gender and age and sort them out so they can be handed out. Corporal Jonathan Neal is overseeing this sorting operation. It's a team effort to organize thousands of toys, but these Marines will tell you the end result is priceless. It's definitely worth all the work, seeing the smiles on their faces. Uh, a lot of these kids, they don't get the opportunity to get toys for Christmas, so you know, it's just a great feeling being able to provide that to them. We're working every hour of the day on our Marine Corps stuff, but we, we gotta make time for the kids. Helping out children, it's, it's what it's all about. In Gulfport, Noah Noble, WLOX News Now.